What's up guys, Yes McGann here, and today we are playing Kernanos in Clash, and I'm gonna be honest, this may be more of a filler video because I personally thought the patch was gonna come out today, but then I looked on Twitter and they put, or they uh, tweeted on the Smite's, I guess Smite's Twitter, that the patch will not be coming out until tomorrow, which was really too bad because I was so excited for the patch to come out because I really want to play New Robin. Like, that's all I've been, all I've been thinking about this weekend, all this week so far is thinking about man Robin's gonna feel so good when that buff comes out and I want to play him in duel I want to play him in conquest I want to play him in every single game mode but that's not gonna be the case at the moment so we're just gonna be playing Karninos in clash and I have a rank three or four Karninos and I haven't played him after he got nerfed so this is this is pretty fresh or yeah he's pretty fresh so I don't know if I will do well this game, we did get the damage buff away. Anubis with a really nice play there. Oh. Giannis is gonna portal us. And I think I'm lagging a little bit. Oh, you know what? It's because I'm at home and I haven't played a hunter since I came home. That's that's probably what it is. Circuit oh Circuit has mana buff. I'll pick this up then. That's probably what it is. I, I just need to get used to it. It's not really that bad of lag, but you know. You kinda have to get used to it when you're playing a hunter. Let's see, what it what's what it, what is it at right now? Yeah, 80. Okay. So a bit higher than what I'm used to. Not really lag or anything, but like I said, you have to get used to a new ping. I've only played melee gods since I've been at home, so... I need to get used to this, since I'm on spring break, of course. Man, I was... All I was gonna do today is, is, is make a video with the new Robin. I was gonna stream a bit because I'm... I wanna play with the new Robin, but... Fortunately, not gonna be the case, but... Oh! Double kill for Sir Ket. Man, the team just comboed so well together right there. Oh my gosh, that was hot. Hot play from Sirket and Kuzumbo. Okay. Yeah, I haven't played this guy since the nerf, like I said, so... I'm not used to him having not having this slow on his two. It seems like he's still pretty good, though, from what I've seen a lot of other players do with this god. And oh, <laughs> Rad Toss are getting caught, getting stunned by the Anubis, and I was able to get my root off. And he did have his dash, but I guess he just wasn't in the best position to use it. Oh my gosh, Amaterasu's so low right now. Yeah, she's gonna go down. She died before uh, Sir Kek could throw, throw them, so. Oh, this could be a dead Nuwa! Anubis with the hot plays. Uh, I didn't have... He had his Aegis, which is kind of weird that he went Aegis on Ching Chan, but we still got the kill! Oh my gosh, we were actually really lucky that we got that. Oh, so low! Okay, we did get the rat, though. Ooh, Sir Cat's here. She's going for it. Nice play from Sir Cat, getting that kill, and we are 3-0-8. This game is 11-2 right now. So not very close. Oh, come on. So low. But I have to back off because New Wall is right there, yeah. There it is. Erlong Shen's going to be able to pick that up and be able to do a bit of damage to New Wall. I have to run, though. Ching Chen's right on my tail. Okay, we're going to be fine. I haven't backed this entire game. I've just been sitting with Death Toll and Boots 1. But <laughs> now we're going to be able to get our Warrior Tabi and actually... I might go Fatalis. Yeah, I think I'll just go Fatalis. Why not? Go Fatalis first item. Not the worst pickup in the world. And I want to go Warrior Tabi, but I don't want to wait for another 50... Nah, I'll just wait. I don't, I don't want to leave the into the map without getting my boots. So we'll get Fatalis and Warrior Tabi here. And after this, I'll go for... I don't know, actually. We'll have to decide while we're playing. I might go Blood Force just for some in, some insane power. Or There's a lot of things I could do. This god's really strong, so you can build pretty much anything on him. And I think Rat may go down here. Ooh, yes, last tick was just enough. Ooh, so low on Nuwa. Okay, we got one. Come on, Janus. There we go. Got a double kill. Spicy, spicy. Gonna get those kills. Amaterasu. Ah, her dash is still available. Not bad. Still gonna be able to get the kills. 
I think he had his healing decreased as well, didn't he? Okay, I can't get those basic attacks. Oh, there was a minion right there. Okay, Kuzumbo, I believe. Save me. Oh my gosh. That rat probably feels bad. We juked him so hard right there. But hot save for my team. Gonna be able... And they got the Rod Tusker as well. Hot save. Kill that mana buff. And I'm gonna go back to base. Good start for us. Good start for the whole team, actually. And... So you know what? I'll actually go Crusher. Let's go Crusher this game. We're gonna go for a Pen and Power. So I'll just go Crusher and then... I don't know, Brawlers, Blood Forge, and then Titan's Bane. Something like that. I don't know. I want to try something out this game. Actually, I'll probably pick up a Chin Size. Alright, we just dashed into a Matarazzi right there. A lot of Matarazzi players get caught like that. And oh, that's going to be a kill. Oh, there's one. Oh, oh, I think she just threw him through the portal. <laughs> I think actually he might have been too close to the portal. So no matter where she threw him, he went through the portal. I'm actually not quite sure how that works with the Cirquet ultimate. Where is he? Is he? He went all the way through. Oh my gosh, he just got wrecked. Poor Ratatosker. Poor Ratatosker. We dashed through him as soon as he used his, his acorn blast and were able just to... Avoid the stun and get away with pretty much murder right there. And I think we can go for this tower. I am kind of low. Oh, no, there's a Matarasu. Okay, never mind. I want to avoid her at the moment, and I'm actually going to max out my one instead of putting another level into my ultimate. I think that will help us out a bit more. And okay, they're going really deep right here. Erlong Shen and Anubis. Erlong Shen actually went Shin Sai's first item. Not something I would really predict, to be honest. He actually didn't hit me with a stun. I used my beats because I thought he would. I'm missing all my basic attacks. Okay, he still died. All good. All good. Okay, we'll go back to base now. Let's see. We'll get the Crusher. I'll just go chin size here. And... Aegis. I don't know why Anubis went over there. I guess he saw Kuzumbo was spamming help, but he shouldn't have. <laughs> Anubis shouldn't have went over there. He was way too low. He was like as healthy as me, which was not healthy at all, so. Sorry. That's okay. We'll put another level into the ultimate now. Clear out this wave. Get up close so we can get the AoE attacks in melee. L little cleave attacks. We're 9 0 and 11. And it's only seven minutes in. Seems like a, seems like a normal a normal game for this god. Of course, one of the stronger gods in the game right now. To be honest, probably broken. Probably a broken god at the moment. Oh, I totally missed my two though. See what we can do. Giannis isn't doing that much damage right now, which is good. This guy's dash is down. Oh, he has the Aegis. There it is. We're going to be able to take that down. Give me that damage buff. Thank you. We'll see if we can get any more here. Okay, we did a bit of damage to Janus. I'm going to do a bit of damage to the tower while, while Nene Kappa is still in range. It looks like they're... Oh. She doesn't want to, want to go back to base quite yet. We should have the tower here. There it is! Got the kill. There's a Janus over here. We'll be able to steal that mana buff. Nice job from the team. Oh. Rack going on Anubis. That's his dash. 
There it is. We're going to be able to finish him off. Nice. We're going to be able to get Janus as well. We did take a lot of damage, though. 12 0 and 12. Oh, we're so gut. We're so fed on this god. Okay, we'll clear out the mana buff and then go back to base. There we go. I will be returning to the base now. Get my chin size. Go chin size, and then we'll go for some more pen. I actually want to. Now nah, we're just gonna. We're not gonna level up our relics. I was thinking I might want to relic. Want to upgrade my beads, but to be honest, that's probably not even an issue. This game. I'm 12 0 and 12 still. I've only used my beads like twice this game, so I'm not too worried. Pretty big stomp. Okay, Kuzumbo is really deep right now, which he can do because he's, of course, extremely tanky, so. Oh, they are. I'm not going to be able to pick that one up. That one's going to be going down. We'll just clear out this wave. And actually, they're going to surrender. GG. That was a 10 minute game. Good game. Good game. Yeah, so that was not very a <laughs> not a very close game. Kernanos, we, we showed what Kernanos can do. <laughs> we definitely showed what he can do. But GG. And, ooh, we got some achievements right there. Season shift. First one of the day, and I guess the other one is uh, fantasy points. Okay, that was for one of the voyage quests. There was still one more I had to get. One more hieroglyph I had to pick up so I could get everything. And, man, we were so fed that game. Actually, Sir Cat was 11-0 as well. That probably made a bigger difference <laughs> this game. And, actually, she only had 9k. She did less damage than Kuzumbo, but she had 11 kills. Kuzumbo did 11k damage. I did 18k at 13 kills, so... Not really, not a really close game. They also didn't have much of a late game because their DPS was going to be quite low without a hunter. They had Janus and Nuwa as their main damage dealers for the later game stages. And I guess Rotoska as well, although Rotoska becomes more of a team-oriented initiator, kind of uh, split pusher-ish god, not really. But he's more set up than he is damage late game because if you go too squishy, you're just going to die instantly. And if you go... A bit more defensive items, you're not going to be doing as much damage as you were able to in the mid to early game stage, or what you should have been doing. He didn't really do all that much damage because, well, their whole team fell very far behind. And they would have had some t a tanky front line, but other than that, not weren't going to be able to do too much later on in the game. We got really fed with Cardinos, who's one of the strongest ga gods in the game right now, might be the strongest. He, he snowballs out of control if you get going. His abilities still hit really hard. His one is still extremely strong, even after the nerfs. They didn't nerf the damage, so he still has that going for him. As well as his two not having the slow, still does a lot of damage, and you can still root people, and it still can zone people off with the dot damage, although not that much damage. It's still decent, especially since we went for Crusher early on, which I thought was pretty good. And Fatalis for a bit more pen. I probably would have went Titan's Vein after these chin size that I picked up, and then... Either Bloodforge or Brawler's Beast Stick. I was thinking Bloodforge because I was fed, and I mean, that's the pentakill item if you're fed in a game mode like Clash or Arena, as well as it gives us a lot of power, so our abilities would be hitting really hard, and as well as our basic attacks because of our first ability, so. Really good game for us. Like I said, this is probably the definition of a filler video because I thought the new patch was going to come out today, and all I wanted to do was play some Robin on the new patch, and then stream but that's not coming out until tomorrow so i'll be making a robin video tomorrow most likely and streaming unless it's a hades video but i think i'm thinking it's probably gonna be the robin video so anyway i hope you enjoyed this has been the sme please like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time peace out